everyone. We have amazing Andrea White here with me today. Um, she has her own consultancy, AW Fire, and she's the founder of Women Talking Fire Networking Group. So, hi Andrea, thanks for, <laughs> thanks for joining me today. Uh, I have just a couple of questions for you. Um, so, could you tell me what does AW Fire do? So I have my own consultancy, AW Fire, and uh, that's been going for three years now. Um, I'm a fire engineer, so I do fire engineering and I do fire risk assessments as well. Uh, and I tend to specialise in working with smaller projects, so perhaps with smaller architectural practices or smaller buildings, rather than perhaps the larger buildings that have got much more prestige. Yeah. Um, and also I do a lot of dispute work. So where people have got um, some challenges with perhaps building control or, or other regulatory bodies, perhaps fire service, um, my background means that I've got a lot of experience in that. So uh, I tend to get involved in that. That's great. Thanks. So another question I have for you is who's your target audience? Who's like your target client? A lot of the times it's actually homeowners particularly with things like the new fire statements, it will be the clients, which are often the homeowners, that, that will be my clients. Um, occasionally, they'll come to me through an architect, um, but often it's, it's, it's a homeowner or an organisation, perhaps um, either a, a company that's building a, a, a project, building a, a particularly new building, or um, maybe... Uh, an organization that is involved in building the building. Okay, thank you. And my last question for you is, what are your values? My strap line for the business is dedicated to competence. I spent my entire career, which in fire safety is about 25 years, uh, studying and gaining qualifications and uh, knowledge. So my strapline is dedicated to competence because I want to provide a high quality service uh, within, within the realms of, of what I know how to do. Um, and I also want to provide really good customer service. So when people phone, they're often really surprised. It is me that answers the phone um, <laughs> and I'm happy to have a chat. And I think people find that quite difficult to understand. Um, but rather than being what's necessarily good business sense, um, I want to do what's right. So, you know, ethically, I want to do what's right. And, and I think people should have access to, you know, technical expertise relatively easily. So, so I want to be the one who answers the phone and, and helps people or points them in the right direction for something. So, yeah, customer service, um, ethics and uh, technical expertise, they're really my values. That's wonderful. Thank you so much for talking to me, answering my questions and joining us today for the Fire Safety Seminar. And it was really nice talking with you and meeting you and just thank you. Absolute pleasure, Olivia. Thank you.